guys, how's she going? It's Trafco. Um, so we're back on the old Aussie map. Two seconds. So here we are, guys. Gonna be planting some grass or hay. So we are using the big bud there, you'll see as well. So we've got the 450 big bud with the. Um, big seed tank there, well, seed box and seed bar. Let's go, boys. Sorry about the back background noise. Um, Corey didn't mute his mic on his on Discord, so there's a bit of fucking background noise as well. Are you there, boy? You yeah, may. I'm doing a little vid, boy. Oh. So hello to all the 400 and something subscribers, boy. Yeah. So I've uh, got a fair bit of seed left in the old seed box, um, so when we get up to the end of the paddock here, I'm going to fix that bit I've missed, I'll try and get the seed bar near the fence, if not, um, don't know, might have to get a smaller seeder to do that. I'm gonna bring these field beans up. Hey. So, um, yeah, I might start a multiplayer let's play. Oh, like, so, well, probably a let's play or some shit. Um, haven't done one for a while. Just doing the uh, second headland up top here, so there's just a square the old paddock off. And I will show you, oh, I'll, I'll jump out of the old 450 here and I'll show you the vehicles we have. So there's my 450 Big Bud and my. That's my spray, uh, self-propelled spray, yeah, the, four, four, the 4440 Patriot with, uh, it's an Aussie style one, there's Corey's R44, R4540 I think, yeah, 40, no, R4045, yeah, that's, I'll make Corey's there, um, here's Corey's 9R, uh, a 9, 9, 9620RX with the tracks on her and he's got the Seed Hawk bar and the Seed Hawk the Seed Hawk 980 seed box as well so he's got the matching rig there uh, what else do we have we'll just tab through got the John D S 690i header with the standard tyres and the matching comb and I've got myself a little T5 just for loading the old sprayer up here. Um, Did we get a seed, t seed tanks in? Yeah, I've got a one, I've got a seed pa plausible seed pallet at the yard where we're at. And yeah. I think Corey's got a 7R, Corey's got a 7R, and I've got a, a TG, a New Holland TG, uh, what is it? Well, I don't know what, what model thing it is, and then I've got the Challenger MT700E with 7, no, 3 metre spacing on it. So there's the Aussie styled Cat Challenger, and the Aussie TG, and last of all, the 7R with the standard row crops on it. That's a bit overkilled for the old field bin, but Corey's just going to 
be taking them to the main yard. I've opened the gates for yeah. you, Corey, so... Thanks, bro. No worries. We'll hopefully be getting into some harvest soon. Oh, we're gonna okay. be smashing out some hay first, Corey, but... Yep. Oh, shit. Getting a little bit of lag, eh? Make sure the old seed bars down properly. And go, boys. So this, I haven't really been using the big buds, but I thought, why not um, actually get the 450? She's got a lot of detail in it for something like this. I really like the two-way in it and the monitor. Oh, uh, well, yeah. <laughs> if I, I, I really want to make this like a mod like this 450 so I can actually um, get the two-way out in the monitor, the uh, screens and shit and put in the, another tractor. Yeah, I'm going to park our field beams up against the fence here. Shipmate, park up. <laughs> so, and we're going to run the um, the F Fergie wind roller, isn't it, Corey? For the yep. hay? Yep. I'll show you a few little edits what I've done. Uh, first of all, I'm going to show you the Massey Ferguson 9870 wind roller. Um, just leave some so I, I will show you what I've done. And the big... The Crone Big Pack, um, one twenty eighty. So I've changed. I've just added the sign on that. Nothing too fancy. So you want to speed time up till daytime, so I can. Yeah. So I don't get so much lag. Yeah, two six, Corey. And let's just speed through the old um d night to the morning. Is that good enough, Corey? Yeah, that's good. Turn time off. So I will show you. Uh, so I've put some uh, oversized sign on the back of her, and one on the front as well, um, and hang on, I just tow the old baler out with the T5, take the guards off it, because it looks better, I guess. But. You wouldn't really see this, but I'm just uh, towing the old baler out with the T5. Okay, I better get fill my truck, my cedar up. So uh, it's just the normal thing, but I've just added the sign on top of it. I did put it on the uh, bale chute though, where the beacon light is. But in Giant's editor, that doesn't show up. So I thought, oh yeah, put it on the old. Bale shoot, but put her in game and it's actually through the beacon but beacon lights so I just put her on top of the baler um, yeah so if you if you message me on the Facebook page if you if you like the baler um, or the wind rower um, I might I don't know might release my edit of it um, yeah Fold back up, seat up. <laughs> so that's the uh, little edit, what I've done to them two things. So we get rid of it now. Right, I need to find my big bud. Um, oh, the 450's around here um, somewhere. Do you have to drive on that trigger there, Trav, to get it to hook up? To fill up on it? Uh, I think so, yeah. This is, there's triggers all around it, I think. Well, I can't get the you to fill up. I'm no good, Corey. Do you want me to try, boy? No, I'll just give a sec. I might be able to get it. Yeah, sh try that, Corey. Where? Um, wait. Oh, I might have to undo the thing. The big seed or... 
But uh, you can crack on with that, can't you, Corey? Yeah, um, oh, there we go. Fill her up. Um, what do you want me to fill up with? Uh, uh go with food. some. I don't know. What do you want to plant? I'm putting grass in. Oh, well, where are you putting that in? Uh, um, that big paddock you sprayed a while ago now. The very first paddock you sprayed, I think. Well, I'll this on here. Oh, this one, yeah. Here, right. This is new hay ground, boys. Yeah, that's the paddock for hay. I'll plant that, um... I was thinking this one next to it, next to this, that one, this one just here, you know what I mean? Where you call it? Oh, that one Paddy there. Chlorine. Yeah, can in, crack it. You can put that, that in. in. You can do that with your cedar. Yeah, put that in, um, what's that? Buddy. So, um, this 450. Uh, Giants have actually put a Cummins in the old Cummins motor. Well, I'm guessing that would that would be the original motor for them, but so I've went for the probably the smallest seed bar in the DLC. Corey's running the big, the biggest one, I think. The big seed wall. So I've got a little bit of hate for the setup. What I'll have on my own save game, I've got the seed seed hook bar and this seed box. Um, yeah, got a little bit of hate about that, but I don't don't give a shit. She looked pretty good, Miss. She looked like a, a good setup. I was actually gonna run that same setup, but I was like, I don't really feel like it. What's this for? The... That setup I have, Cory, with this grey seed box in the big seed hawk bar. I've got a fair bit of hate about that. Oh, do you have a seed hawk bar on there? No, nah, no, nah, I've, uh, I've got the little, that medium, uh, the one down from yours, I've got. Oh, the red one? Yeah, the red bar. Alright. Oh. So we don't really need a thumbnail, because I've got that taken that already before I start to record. We're all good about that. Shit. Now I'm going to try and get right on this fence and put some seed in here. Oh yeah, you got that set up. That set up's um, a good set up actually. Can I say so? Yes, so as you guys probably know there is a bigger Big bud, but I've got I like this one more. Just because I don't know, I just like this big bud for some reason. Uh, you do see big. It's rare to come by with some big buds in Australia. I think. Um, she's actually. It's a rare tractor to come by. I think it is, just let me know if it's rare or not, but I don't know, I could be making shit up now, but... Right, watch our seeds. Oh, I've got a fair bit of seed. Got a big capacity on the on this big seed bar, uh, box. Um, it's yeah. great when you get shit, yes. Are oh, you lagging, boy? Oh, I was. I... Uh, 15 FPS now. <laughs> this one on the map. If I was playing single player, it wouldn't be as bad. But... Yeah. With multiplayer, you get a f you get a fair bit of work done. Depends what you're doing. So, yeah. So this is, um, <coughs> this map's Strathman's, Strathman's Farm, isn't it? Strathman Farms. Strathman, I don't know how to say it. Um, 
I don't know. I just call it Ben's map. I think it. This Ben. This is made by Ben, isn't it? Ben Kennett. Oh, mate, Ben, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. She's a. It's a really big map when you first get on, but when you have a few hours on it, she's easy to conquer some some acres and shit. I'm thinking about this, but I should not. Let's see how big our bar is. Though. Is there a collision on these power poles? No, it's not. I don't know. Good. There's a boom on my spray, it hasn't got broken, so. Okay. My bar went straight through the old power pole. Oh well, oh, that's how we roll, boys. Okay, I like that. I'm gonna plant this in wheat, this paddock. Wheat. Oh yeah. yeah. I might put this GPS over a little bit. So we're gonna go here, there. Set our thing all the way out. So we're trying to go for a Johnny fleet, but there's some imported stuff like New Holland Case, um, Cat Challenger, and Big Bud, and there's two New Hollands, isn't there now, Corey? Yeah. I've got no words to say about this big 450. She's my, well, how many hours she got on it? Uh, 0 0.5. That's uh, good. Mine's got 0 0.2 on it. <laughs> uh, we, um, like before I brought this old 450, um, I did have an old as a Cummins motor in it, but I've tr uh, swapped her out and put a brand spanking new one in for, um, yeah. Oh, look at the FPS now. Oh, did you get seed? Did the seed work in your... I'm guessing it worked. Yeah. I'm just putting my seed on cruise control and not, not doing it itself. I've got GPS on and I'm just sitting back and doing yeah, some Snapchats, boy. Well, in, I've never used GPS in real life. I've seen it get set up in the um, spreader trucks. That's about all, I think. Sometimes they're a pain in the butt to set up, that's all I'm going to say. I've driven a tractor with GPS in it. Yeah, same. So like, I haven't, haven't operated it like, with the GPS. Nah, fuck G GPS is for lazy cunts. Oh, not really, sometimes. Do you know how my pop used to do, uh, when he used to, um, when he was farming? Do you know what the GPS was? The, you get in your tractor, and you look at the post straight ahead for you, and just follow that post. Like, dead straight on with that oh, post. Yeah. That's the old GPS style, boy. Back yeah, in the day, a, that was the very one. first fucking GPS ever made. Just a post on the other side of the paddock, boys. People used to freaking go along with spray paint and mark out um, a straight line straight across their paddock. Yeah, I've seen that happen. Uh, oh, well, I've seen a video about it. Uh, I thought that was pretty so smart. Keep, yeah, because then they follow that the first time, and then they, as they keep going across. It just stays straight. Yeah. So we're playing a little bit really, um, led, uh, realistic. Uh, we've only got a million dollars. I wouldn't say that's realistic, but, um... This farm's probably worth about a good five million bucks. Oh, easy boy. 
in real life if it was. Oh yeah, it'd be getting up in a couple mil, I reckon. She's yeah. pretty. She's pretty big. So we might actually, f when this gets to probably about the second stage of growth, we're gonna have to chuck a bit of spray down on the ground to kill off the bugs and shit. But yeah. Which, oh no, need some fur, a bit of sp um, spread down on the ground, wouldn't we? A wreath, rear. Yeah. Well, um, yeah. shit. Do you know what you, we haven't seen in... Flash. Hey? My CD in the two flash today. <laughs> no. Do you know what we have down in Tasmania? Impact, where the, all our fur fertilizer comes from and elders and roberts oh yeah it's yeah. basically like um crt and that mm. yeah we have that down here as well yeah oh there's only like three three of them in tasmania somewhere i think down hobart yeah. ernie lowell system shit that's a pretty decent place come up to that we're gonna get a lot off this, so, you know. <laughs> like, so that's the old um, hay paddock seeded in. I'll jump the fence. This fence is turned off, isn't it, Corey? No power going through her? Which one? The one in between us. Is there power going through oh. this fence? Nah, that's a new standard barbed wire fence, mate. <laughs> we'll fucking jump. Oh, I just fucking jabbed myself, cunt. Did you oh, buy wait. that paddock? That's what I thought, no. Corey. <laughs> You better buy it for us, because I haven't got any money. Yeah, go, boy. Thanks, boy. Now I can finish seeing this paddock. <laughs> Look at that big rig. Look at that fucking big Johnny pulling that fucking, like, th uh, well, what meter is that? What meter fucking oh. seed bar is that? Uh, 25.6 meter. So what would that be in foot? Yeah, 37. Yeah, that's a fair. That wouldn't be the big. Oh, that'd probably be the biggest one. Nah. No. Nah. Nah. Stop for a second, Corey boy. Oh, yeah. You good to go, boy? The biggest one is like um, 50 foot or something, and they use two 8 RTs to pull it. Oh yeah, I've seen a photo on like a fa on Facebook. Yeah, they have big art. Farm. They have um big, big two. Farms what are they? Nine RTs are they? Right, and they've oh, got eight RTs. Uh, eight RTs, pulling a big yeah. seed bar and seed box. It's fucking mean, boys. No, it's an eight RT and a nine RT. Pretty yeah. Sure. It's one big one big rig. Can I say so myself? <laughs> yeah, boy. Anyhow, guys, I uh, hope you enjoy the old multiplayer Let's Play. Um, yeah, there's going to be more videos to come. So I uh, hope you enjoy it. Uh, and we'll catch you next time. Comment, rate, and subscribe for more videos, boys. I'll catch you later. And this is Travco and Corey. So what?